Hi guys, welcome to Judy Speaks where I talk anything about pimple, acne, and skincare. So right now, I have a very big pimple and then I'm trying to get rid of this bad boy using only one product. And hydrogen peroxide, yes, hydrogen peroxide. The ones that you use for treating or cleansing the wounds and for bleaching. I'm going to show you how to do it, the do's and the don'ts. You need to clean your face. Make sure to pat it dry, okay? You need to pat dry your skin so that when we put the hydrogen peroxide to your skin, it can penetrate and work easily, okay? If you have sensitive skin and then you apply directly any forms of products, especially anti-acne products to um, a wet or damp skin, tendency is you will have irritation. So let's do away with that one. So pat it right. So next is since this is quite strong, this one, this is 20 volumes. And as you can see also in the indications and directions, you need to dilute it with equal parts of water. So that's what we're going to do as well. So since I don't have any dropper, we will use this cup. So put one cup of this I'll just use this one because I don't have any bottle and the other one is of course water what kind of water not the mineral water your tap water no no use the I have here the distilled water <laughs> so equal parts also so one is the one okay so after that if you have a small bottle or a dropper, you can put it there and you can use it for, for, for future use. So, we will not be using cotton. The reason, the tendency with cotton is that it, it, it's quite big and if you will put it in one area, the ones that doesn't have any pimple is also, can also absorb the, um, the solution, this one. So, we will use this one, the Q-tip or your cotton buds. Dip it and then use it directly. Okay? Like this. Oh, I can feel it. The sting. Just like when you apply it in your wounds. You don't need to put a, to, a lot of pressure. Just make sure you are touching only the pimple area this is very drying okay uh, you put it in the spot the pimple itself for five minutes the reason why hydrogen peroxide is used as a acne treatment it's because it kills bacteria in the surface level and we all know that the reason why we have pimples or acne is because of bacteria. Because once hydrogen peroxide is applied to the skin, it releases its extra oxygen. So there's too much oxygen. And then it's making the bacteria um, uncomfortable with its environment killing it and therefore healing your pimple that's the logic of hydrogen peroxide but then again guys you apply hydrogen peroxide every other day for two weeks so for example i use it monday tuesday i will not be using it wednesday i'll use it thursday i it's just alternate okay don't use it straight like Monday to Friday because it's really really drying and you don't want that especially if you have sensitive skin and so question regarding hydrogen peroxide you can comment it down below I also heard hydrogen peroxide and they're using it as a um, to erase their scars 
their hyperpigmentations, but I discourage it. I'm only using hydrogen peroxide as a spot treatment for my acne. And it's very effective. I've done this, I've done this um, so many times before. But if you have like too many uh, pimples and acne, um, you better use um, another um, product that is really designed for pimples. If you want an immediate result, you can use this, but only um, two weeks. Okay, only two weeks. And I recommend that you use moisturizer after your mm, treatment, your hydrogen peroxide treatment. Another question, can you, can, should you use toners before putting the hydrogen peroxide? Yes, you can. And then just make sure that you do not use hydrogen peroxide um, every day for two weeks hydrogen peroxide um, do not use it in in its concentrated form except if it's just one percent that's okay that's that's tolerable to your skin and then use it as spot treatment only overnight uh, maximum is two weeks alternate days use moisturizer afterwards or if you do not use um, any moisturizer that's okay as long as you dilute it in water don't forget guys to subscribe like comment down below if you find this useful or is there other remedies that you can share in my channel that I can try or others can try and also well, I'll see you on my next video